Sterling's hypothesis says that the net filtration through capillary membrane is proportional to the hydrostatic pressure difference between the membrane across the membrane minus the oncotic pressure within the capillary so if we draw a capillary like this this is the arterial end and this is the venous end here the blood is coming directly from heart so the hydrostatic pressure means the blood pressure will be more it is around 37 mm hg and here the venous blood has low hydrostatic pressure in capillary so it is around 18 mm hg and the oncotic pressure here is the oncotic pressure is produced by the plasma proteins due to its large size cannot penetrate or pass through the capillary membrane oncotic pressure produced by the plasma protein is around 25 25 mm hg this is oncotic pressure So according to Starling's hypothesis, before we discuss about Starling's hypothesis, let us see the hydrostatic pressure outside the capillary means in the interstitial fluid, interstitial space. Here it is 2 mm hg and here it is 3 mm hg so according to formula the net hydrostatic pressure is 37 minus 2 that will be 35 mm hg and here 18 minus 3 that will be the net pressure will be 15 mm hg now according to formula if we minus the oncotic pressure that is 25 and from here also 25 the result will be 10 mm hg and here minus 10 mm hg so here due to the due to hydrostatic pressure is more the fluids will move out of the capillary leaving the plasma proteins inside and making it concentrated with proteins and, uh, and from here uh, along and from here along with the fluid it will take nutrients and other uh, essential substances from for the cells and from and here in the venule part since the hydrostatic pressure is less here 
less than the oncotic pressure the due to the due to oncotic pressure the fluid will come back into the capillary and make the blood cell diluted again and along with the fluid the metabolites metabolic wastes like carbon dioxide and other excretory products will come with the fluid and get into the blood and taken you to the excretory organs like kidney and livers and lung